We have only two more weeks of regular season high school football. And for some, the season went by pretty quickly. For others, though, they need every game they can get as they set up to make a push for the playoffs. The playoffs. A chance for players and coaches to show the rest of the state just exactly what your team is made of. This year, though, teams don't get in with just wins. They need playoff points. A system that makes teams schedule tougher and unfamiliar opponents. And for the Sault Ste. Marie Blue Devils, it's an uphill battle. We got into the Northern Michigan Football Conference, um, you know, uh, before we actually had a, an idea that this was going to be the playoff system. So our schedule was basically set um, before this system was implemented. You know, with the idea that we would still have been to play some tougher teams in the conference we were in, we finally had a conference affiliation after being independent for so many years. Uh, and then the irresistibly, you know, changed the system and, and really it, it's kind of hurting us now. The team currently sits at 4-3 and three with two games left to play in the regular season with a third straight playoff berth on the line. So the question becomes, how do you keep the season and the streak alive? We've got a lot of kids, uh, you know, a good group of seniors who we have brought up. Uh, our quarterback we brought up as a freshman. Uh, you know, he's never had a losing season. He's been to the playoffs twice. We've got uh, three or four starters on the varsity who are seniors. We brought up as sophomores who have never not been to the playoffs. So, you know, this is kind of their opportunity to have some ownership and, and keeping that streak alive. Easier said than done. But for the Blue Devils, it's been there, done that. It's now almost like two different seasons that we can, you know, we play this do or die mentality and like every game is your last, which in some ways it is. Um, and then we get, we get to kind of regroup and refocus. And then, you know, if we get in, we play for that second season. And since we've been through it enough, I think that, um, you know, the kids have their focus and their minds in the right places. Thank you for watching ABC 10 News on YouTube. For the latest Upper Peninsula news, weather, and sports, be sure to subscribe to our channel and like us on our Facebook page.